Well, hello there everybody, I'm Grand Admi and welcome back to the city of Tectonia. Yeah, well, off camera I let some time go past, not much, just got about 15,000 simoleons again. And I also uh, sat back and just took a look at how the city was running and I noticed this. Yep, that's right. We're starting to get the traditional backlog off the highway. And it has nothing to do with this little pitiful little intersection here. So, I have come up with a solution for this. It's Operation New City Spot. We're going to actually buy this new area. We've got some oil, we've got some ore, we've got some fertile land, and above all, we've got some trees. Alrighty. This tile doesn't contain too much water, I don't think. Uh, yeah, I guess it does. Purchase. Boom. Also, I was thinking, I know I want to eventually expand down this way. Right, down this highway, pre used, used to pre-built highway line. But we may also continue to expand down this way. But the way I've come up to fix this traffic problem is first of all double check our ore resources here and see just how much ore we've gotten here. So, two things are going to happen here. One, Soilton's going to expand into becoming some more because you can look at our demand and you can see we've got a huge demand for industrial. Okay, Soilton has expanded and all of this out here is going to be Rockton. In fact, this entire area back in here is going to be Rockton. Uh, I know there's a bigger brush. No, I probably am not going to use it. Rockton is going to be this huge super district. Okay, also, I've made an executive decision. This little portion will no longer be a portion a part of Rockton. So, yeah, so. Soil tin is actually going to be redesignated as a farming area. Now, farming will only pop up, or at least it should only pop up, uh, if there is fertility for it. So, like back here in the back. But this means we're also going to need an actual true industrial area, and that's where a new district is going to come in, right here. It's actually going to be fairly small, and it's, it's most of the industry is going to be held by um, Okay, but you can see things are actually getting rezoned here. But the way I'm going to solve this is we're actually going to probably upgrade probably this road here. to uh, Big Mother, to this size. Okay. And this size is going to go out and it's going to meet this, this road out here, this highway. Okay. And it's going to go to about there, I'm hoping. Okay. As you can see, we're getting some farms rebuilt in here. I'll rename Crest Hills here shortly. This is going to hopefully redirect some of the industrial traffic from here onto this road. So, now we get to enjoy my attempt at highway exits. 
So, first off, they need to be able to come off here. Okay. Like so. They also need to be able to exit, so there we go. Like so. Now we need to be able to exit off of here. So that means coming up. And over. That also means coming up. Come on. There was an area over there. There was a spot there. I know there was a spot there. Right there. Awesome. So there's my there's one of my first little interchanges. It looks nothing like that, but it works. And it should help hopefully allow fewer trucks to come through here. Will be good. All right. So now we've got this huge demand for commercial we need to address. But for right now, I'm gonna come in here. I'm actually going to create a small little area here that's going to literally parallel these this stuff, and it's going to be straight. So. And this is going to be one hell of a complicated area. Not really. Okay, that actually doesn't need it. And all of this is going to be traditional industrial. This is our industrial corner. This is where the vast majority of all industrial projects will take place. I have so, so decreed it. Okay. Also going to zone another area here for ore. And then we're going to have to addre address some of this stuff. So, power. Awesome. We can get rid of some of the power lines here. That one, that one, that one. Which means there's a little tiny little bit of industrial we can zone right there. Also, okay, okay, yes, that's what I wanted to see. Trucks utilizing this this area here. This is probably going to be all of the industry we will ever need in this city. Okay. That being said, we're going to need workers and we're going to need a small little downtown area out here. Also, they're going to need water over there. So, let there be water. Right about yeah. Alrighty, so... For... A small little downtown area. I need a new district that's going to be... Actually, let's extend you out here to the edge of this curve here. Like so. Alright, now. Out here, we're going to bound it by a road, like so. And through it, going to be this road. And 
in here. First off, we need water. And then we need commercial. Commercial. This inner this little inner area here is actually going to be office spaces. And then on the outside we're going to put in commercial, or not commercial, residential. And as our residential demand is starting to kick up because we've started to redo a bunch here with this. With all of our industry being very ore centered uses a lot of workers. So now, got ourselves a very beautiful little, little downtown area starting to grow up here. One thing we're going to want to put in here is we're going to want to put in a decent sized park. And that's going to go right there. It's not going to compromise the integrity of the office spaces when we get them in. Off of this, we're going to do one, two, three little areas. Now, we're also going to need access back here eventually. It's going to come via this and this and back over here. It's going to be bounded Did by this road. Okay. This is going to come out here, eventually, but we're also going to bring out this road as well. Now, this little area, you're going to see me do this now. Um, this little spot right in here. There's a railroad that's going to come through here. So. This road is going to connect here, here, to there. And then this is all going to be residential. They just don't know it yet. And I haven't zoned it as such yet. enough money. Guess we'll uh, sit back and let the money come come in. Okay. Here. Well, at the same time, we're actually going to zone in. Bring in a new, new district here. This is going to be its own district.
this road's actually not going to belong to any district. Well, up until here. Four reasons. So, now, I do recall us being getting our next city thing, so I actually, there's one more policy I need to grab. That's recycling. It's going to slightly reduce tax income, but it's going to reduce garbage accumulations. That's going to be, that's going to be big. Okay. Also, this zone here, this district needs to come out here, and this needs to be cleared away. That is so... Heavy traffic can continue along this road. Now, in here, we need another, another road here. Come right down the center. Connect in there. I'm going to need water in here. I need water. Also, this rail line is going to be right along here, so there's going to be a gap right here, here for that rail line. Now, that's where that um, place is. I'm going to try and get some residential pop up there so I can get rid of that. One house is already built, that's awesome. And we're just going to continue down this line for now. And note that I'm not zoning. Okay, now is when I'm going to come here and I'm going to literally zone these bit by bit. Right there. All on this one little street. This is just to get the zones tick, uh, kicking. so I can get rid of these power lines. I don't like power lines in my cities. Example. I wish I could get rid of this one, but I can't just yet. Uh, probably when I get down over here, I'll be able to get rid of it. Or use, that's 58% full. Quite able to get rid of that. Alright, so now it's going to be a good ch uh, chance to take a look at our educational thing. I think we've got enough education. We're going to need a new high school. I'm going to probably plop that high school down right over here. Over here in High District. Um, this is actually going to be the. This is going to be. Oh, uh, what do I want to call this? It's in between commercial, so this is going to be intermediate. Uh, in in garden in garden. Welcome to in garden. Okay. And this is going to be less, this is going to be lower, lower, lower town. Crest Hills is going to become, comes, uh, in Smoke City. And we'll run from there. Okay. Now, there's something else we're going to need to do here soon. 
And that's this bus depot. And it's going to be down over here. Down over here is going to be a lot of my actual rail stuff. Or mass transit is it stuff. So. Hey. Running out of power. Damn it. Damn it. Boom. Let there be more power. So. We need 19,000 people for the solar power plant. Okay. Now I'm going to come in here and I'm going to zone most of this area here now. This stuff here gets dezoned. There's a reason for that. I don't want residential cropping up there. As this little belt here. Then we come home to some mighty fine traits. Yay! We're now a busy town. Got access to city planning policies, level 4 unique buildings, oil industry specialization. The new policies we've got is heavy traffic ban and free public transport. And we finally got all of our beautiful new roads here. Finally. Also, we got a police headquarters, fire station, or a oil power plant and a hospital. Next, we're going to be working on 7,000. And that's where we're... And metro station, university, incineration plant. And... Yeah, those. Um, okay. So, requirements locked. Oh, these are level five buildings, right? All right. So, in here we're just going to plop down some trees. And it's going to continue all the way down here. is how we're going to spend most of this episode. It's just planting trees, I think. As of reasons. I think I'll get some diversity into here. Uh, trees are awesome because it allows us to block noise and will also eat up some pollution as well. So, the more trees we have between the, the residential and the industrial here, the happier most of us will be if we choose to live over here. And I'm hoping people are going to choose to live over here. And some big trees, just kind of... This has been a massive... Um, Foresty, forestry project by the city. They want want our citizens to feel like they got okay. So crap. <laughs> and sometimes all of our best intentions don't exactly work. I mean, it is working, which I am thankful for, in that I don't have as much traffic going through this intersection, but we're still getting quite a bit of stuff going through this intersection. <laughs> That's what happens. Oh well. 
So, other things that need to happen now. Um, we can now work on upgrading roads here. But, um, this makes our people a little bit happy. Um, yes, it's going to get rid of some of the buildings. They'll grow back. And I'm going to do this one district at a time. And in here, this is going to be grass. And then we're going to go to trees down the line. Down the middle here. Occasionally, we'll get... Um, occasionally with, with buildings, they'll kind of get stuck. It's probably the best way of putting it. But now if we look at our noise pollution and stuff, so if we go to pollution, you'll note that this stuff no longer... The, the, where it would be just kind of spilling out over this road, it's not anymore. It's just sitting there, it's contained by the trees. As for the noise pollution, it's always loud, but this, this, see how it would expand over that road? This road is now, um, these trees are blocking that noise pollution a lot from getting over in here, which is good. So. Now we need to grab our second school, or our second high school, like so. I want to park in here. And by park, I mean park. Now we can come in here, we can finish zoning out all of this. Move for that little bit there. This little bit is going to get the glory of being commercial. Like so. Also, we'll, you'll note that we've got some more industry demand. And they had built out um, Smoke City here. So, means it's um, time to get Soilton going here. So, out here it's going to be... Uh, this is actually going to be this type of road going in there. Down to there, down to there, and jumping on there. And then I don't like that. That needs to be fixed. Like so. And then finally right here is going to be another one of these roads. I'm going a little bit away from the straight aspect to get a little bit of curvy aspect here. In here. Uh, that's just the way it is. And then this road will be the dirt. And let the farms continue. Because if you remember correctly, this area here is, is high farming area. So, that's good. Now, I zone that little bit. Zone off along here. And up along this one as well. And holy crap, it's already been 30 minutes. Told you we were going to spend a lot of time with those trees. 
Oh, Soilton's getting a little bit of an expansion. Industry's booming. And yeah, we've got um, In Garden here. Here. Um, probably going to do a lot of road upgrading off camera. That way we're not getting bogged down by it. So, until tomorrow, I'm Grand Enemy. Thanks for joining us here in the city of Tectonia. See you later.